Hello. Uh, today I'm going to present for you a new tool from Stonfo. This is the Stonfo Razor. Um, just to say it, this is not the time of, uh, type of uh, tool that uh, at Italian men use their shavings. Uh, this is the tool they use for uh, sculpting deer hair bodies. So that's what I'm going to show to you now. Um, first of all, we got this package. Uh, it comes with a large package of uh, razor blades, like this. I just pick one out here to assemble it to the tool. And then we have the tool itself. I tried it and I used it. You can adjust the uh, tension here. So now I'm going to put this razor blade into this tool. You see this notch here? Notch or whatever it is. You can just place it over the... And just be careful not to cut your hands. This is a little bit tricky in the first time. There you have it. Okay, you see, now this uh, blade is uh, is uh, clear for a, a straight cut, you know, but we, you, you can adjust the tension here, and you see how the blade keeps curving. So, this comes later on, but now I'm going to show for you how to use this tool. I have this little unfinished mouse here. Mouse. You see, this is a deer hair mouse. The first, first one I'm gonna use uh, this uh, tool for now is to uh, cut on the bottom of this mouse. It, it needs a, a straight cut because the bottom of the mouse is flat. Okay? Just adjust this tool so it becomes perfectly flat. Okay, so flat I want it, yes. Let's take this uh, little mouse here in my hands. Just have to squeeze the air upwards so don't, don't cut it. Okay, just you see how sharp this thing is. It's razor sharp. <laughs> okay, maybe because it, it's, a, it's a razor. Just, you see? Very nice. Very nice cut. Okay, just uh, have to adjust it a little bit. And uh, when I'm at it, I just uh, use the scissors to take off the edges here. Okay, on the bottom and in the front as well. Just Turn it around. Just have to use it like that. Be careful not to cut the hairs. But if I cut the hairs, the mouse will not hear shit. So I want that. I don't want that. So, okay. You see, now I cut this mouse flat, flat on the bottom. So, uh, it will be a very nice flat surface here. Okay, now I'm gonna take this, turn it, put it aside for a bit, and have to adjust this uh, tool here. Turn the knob, okay? So it becomes uh, curved. Uh, this is the kind of curve, uh, curvation I, I want, you see? Okay. Now I'm gonna use it on the head. Uh, I reckon you, a lot of you have seen a mouse before, so it will have a, a curved head just in front. Just have to squeeze it towards the ears. You see, it becomes a little flat. Just okay. 
just have to adjust it a little bit. See, I'll, I'll be just have to glue this a little air on afterwards you see now I'm just uh, finished with the uh, cutting this mouse is now uh, fully hairdressed so uh, uh, this is the tool from Stonefall uh, and uh, this is how the mouse looks when it's fish finished you see this is a deer and mouse created by me with the tools of Stonefall. So uh, thank you all for watching this video and I uh, welcome you back to uh, my next uh, preview, uh, review. <laughs> um, it will be more uh, tools from Stonefall out now soon. So bye bye. <music>